Welcome to the 2011 Bath Film Festival. Over the last 21 years, it's become one of the most talked about and successful festivals here in Bath, with a wide range of previews, documentaries and special one-off events. To date, the festival has brought over a thousand great films to Bath, from Hollywood headliners to children's animation. A great supporter of British film, last year the festival previewed The King's Speech three months before its general release. At the opening night, we spoke to the festival organisers to see what they are most looking forward to at this year's festival. Um, there's a lot of films to choose from and it's, uh, it's always difficult to pick one or two, but there are, I think the things I look forward to most are the films when we're having a special presentation like tonight when we've got the director and the main person in the film appearing. So for example, we're doing a screening of Wuthering Heights and the scriptwriter for that is coming down for the screening, which is exciting. And there's a film called Shame, directed by Steve McQueen with Michael Fassbender and Kerry Mulligan. And the producer of that, a guy called Ian Canning, who produced The King's Speech, is coming to that as well. So that's the kind of thing I like when there's a special presentation of a new film and you get a chance to ask questions afterwards. What I find is that something relatively small kind of creeps up and takes you by surprise. So something like uh, Black Pond, I think, I'm really looking forward to seeing that. Um, I remember a few years ago we showed a completely obscure film and uh, somebody came out after the screening came up to me and said thanks so much for putting that film on it's changed my life you know and that's the kind of experience we're, we're, we're looking to generate as well as it being the festival's 21st year this year also celebrates the 75th birthday of the founding patron Ken Loach we caught up with him to discuss his thoughts on Bath Film Festival well, I, I tried to ignore my anniversary. Um, the festival's done done very well, I think. Um, I think festivals get more important as uh, cinemas. What you can see in the cinemas gets narrower and narrower. The range isn't very wide. Um, and so the, the, the festivals offer an opportunity for people to see films from across the world that you wouldn't see otherwise. So they're very important. I mean, Bath's a good city for festivals. It, it's a good size. It's not too big where festivals can get lost in very big cities. I mean, London has a film festival, but you could walk through London and not know it. Um, Bath is a good size for a festival. That's it from me and everyone here at the Bath Film Festival. You can keep up to date on the website and Twitter. I'll see you next year. Bye.